Hi, this is George, and in this short video, I'm going to show you a couple of web browser tools that I use multiple times a day that make my web browsing more fun, uh, more efficient, uh, and it gives me more focus in my work. Okay, so I think this will be quite helpful for, for you as well. So first thing is I use Google Chrome as my web browser, and the main reason I like it is because all of my bookmarks are connected to my Google account. So if I need to uh, use someone else's computer, so I, sometimes I use my wife's laptop, and so when I'm using her laptop, I can log, I can open Google Chrome, log into my account, and all of my bookmarks are there. So my bookmarks are not tied to a, to a computer, physical device, but it's on the cloud, and I like that a lot. So um, next thing I want to show you is there are a couple of free tools on Google Chrome that make uh, browsing so much uh, more efficient. One tool is called uh, One Tab. Okay. Oh, actually, before I show you One Tab, I want to show you. Uh, did you know that if you have a bunch of browser tabs open and you're getting overwhelmed, or you just simply want more simplicity so that you can have more focus? And I do this multiple times a day. Uh, and I don't want to delete them all, but I want to keep them. Maybe is I click on Bookmarks. Okay, and I click Bookmark All Tabs. And then I will name this. Uh, I will I will go to my my folder called Sort, and then within the Sort folder, I will start a new folder and I'll just name it Today's Date, um, Today's Date, and then I'll press OK, and there all my bookmarks are now in the Sort folder under Today's Date. You see that? And then once I, if I want to open all of them again, I can click on Open All Bookmarks. Oh, I, it's not in the screen here. But uh, if I wanted to open all my bookmarks, I would go to a folder and I'll click on Open All Bookmarks. Okay, so um, that's one thing. Now, the other thing I actually use more often is called One Tab because I know that most of the time, the tabs I open, I don't really need to bookmark. So this, uh, this One Tab tool is free, and I will give you the link in the notes for the video. I click on One Tab, and look what happens immediately collapses all the tabs into a single tab this what is a one tab and it gives me the title so that I know all right which of these do I actually am I working on right now and I'll click on the ones that I'm actually working on right now I'll click on this one I'll click on my calendar I'll click on my Google Drive and the rest let's just say that the rest I don't really need it's not you know it's not necessary then I click on delete all from this page here I click delete all and I click OK and there, I've just cleared my, I just cleared all my tabs. Very simple, very easy, and I've only kept the ones that I that I really like. All right, the other, t the next tool I want to show you is whenever I open a new tab on Google Chrome, instead of showing me my most popular web uh, websites, which makes me can make me distracted, instead it shows me this beautiful picture, and the picture changes regularly. Uh, it tells me the time and even asks me what is my main focus for today. I can type in a word or phrase to say what my main focus is today. It gives me an inspirational quote that I can hover over and see who it's from. I can even click on the, um, the photo uh, thing down here to see where the source of the photo is. So I love this. It's called Momentum. I will also add a link to, to the brow um, in the notes for this video. Okay, next thing I want to show you is let's say um, the next thing I want to show you is uh, let me actually close off some of these tabs here next thing I want to show you is every day when I come into my work and my computer I have a bookmark folder by the way bookmark folders you can create by clicking on bookmarks clicking on bookmark manager and then you can uh, under the bookmark bar you are right next on top of the bookmark bar, I recommend that you you click on you right click on it, right click on it to open this little menu. What is right click? For those of you who don't know, on a Mac, it's hold down the control key and click, and then it opens this menu, and then you can create you can add a folder um, that will then show up here in the bookmarks bar. Okay, if the bookmarks bar is not there for you for some reason, you can click on view and click on always show bookmarks bar. Okay, all right. So every day when I come into my work. I, I, I right click on what I call the daily folder. This is all the things I want to open immediately when I start my day. I right click on it or control click uh, if you're on a Mac, hold down control and click it. And then I click open all bookmarks from my bookmark uh, daily folder. Okay. So now that I've opened all bookmarks, here's what I do. I, uh, uh, I know that I use many of these throughout the day. Okay, so I, I want to keep them, but I want that I don't want them to clutter up my, my view. So I use this thing called um, pin all tabs. So I click on this thing, 
and instantly these all get pinned these all get pinned which means that they're smaller i know exactly what they are because i use them all the time there's my calendar there's my email there's a facebook uh, there's you know google drive i already have one of those open right here uh, there's my habits tracking thing um, yes a document reminding me what i what i do every day that kind of thing so um, the pin all pin all tabs is very useful because when i now open a new tab let's say i want to go to i don't know i want to go to um, linkedin.com right these tabs and then i want to go to you know um, googleplus.com okay these tabs are all normal tabs whereas these ones are pinned so if I want to quickly check what my uh, what my um, uh, email is I can click on here and see my email it's right there um, versus these tabs so these these icons I know what they mean in other words so pin tabs is very useful because I kind of I basically keep many of these open throughout the day so I can quickly check on certain things uh, so anyway I hope that's useful for you I will put the links to these tools in the notes for the video and um, try out one, try out all of them, and let me know if it's helpful. All right, take care.